Especially with how amazing last episode was and how crazy it ended, this episode being called Defeating an Upper Rank Demon gets me way too excited. We finally get to do this. What's up Dapper Squad, it's your boy Sleepy Darius, back at it again, barely off any sleep, just woke up, ready to record some Demon Slayer for you guys. I'm sure five minutes into this episode I'll be awake and ready to go at them like usual. Last episode we had Tengen and Tanjiro versus Kyutaro, and we had Inosuke and Zenitsu versus Daki, and then we had Hinatsuru, who I think I got it wrong, I said it was Suma last episode, who ended up coming to help with some flying projectile kunais, who seemed to be laced with some wisteria type poison, preventing Gutaro from being able to regenerate quickly. And then Tanjiro's coming in with the sword right against that kunai to see what he can do to finish the job. I am super excited, super eager, super anticipating this ending to this demon, ending to this arc. I, I think including this one after this we have two more episodes for this arc this season i have no idea i'm very sad because it came and went so fast but i'm also excited because i've been loving this arc loving the animation loving the fight so i gotta find out what happens don't forget if you guys want the full length version of this episode and the early access and the full length of any of the other shows i'm watching on the channel make sure to check out that patreon the links are in the description like always for you guys if you guys want to support me and patreon's not really your thing if you guys could just leave me a like and a nice comment it really does help me with that youtube algorithm don't forget to subscribe to the channel and to click that notifications bell guys so you guys always know exactly when i post over here on the dappers channel um follow all the social medias instagram twitch tiktok twitter all the dapper darius much appreciated y'all let's hop into this demon slayer key message to no yaiba season 2 episode 16 defeating an upper rank demon let's do this i'm way too excited i love that shot you just see out of nowhere tanjiro right next to him they're both just full-fledged going after oh my god all right episode 9 defeating an upper rank demon another flashback the Uzui family grave. I'm assuming it's one of the siblings, or because I know of his siblings, only him and his brother survived, who they had huge disagreements with. Can you guys tell me? Shouts out to you, Tengen. I don't plan on you dying t anytime soon either. But is he, is this equivalent to pouring one out for the homie? This is your sibling, so it's bigger than home but like he literally is doing that you know wishing we could drink together one day <laughs> dig in as be as flashy as you can hell yeah good because none of them had the option to they've all were just forced into that shinobi <laughs> yeah yeah we know you guys know we all get why tengen does the things he does how amazing this man is i love cherry blossoms the color the time that they bloom in, it's lovely. <laughs> Damn. Oh, and it's a Rickaria. But he was able to regrow his legs. Oh my god, even with the wisteria. Rotating circular slashes, flying blood scythes. That is pretty damn crazy. Good save, Tengen. Constant resounding slashes. I love how they make it like a firework. Like he's so flashy. Oh my god. Please don't, please don't kill her. She was the one who shot the kunai, so make. She said, please don't mind me. I love. I love how they do the art style and the animation for this flashback. It's so well animated, and it's just the saturation and the color scheme from the sunset, you know? Okay, that was like their goal, their tangible goal. No. They are not. No. 
They're not setting this up for her to die, but I love how socially observant she's been. She's always been that one. I'm praying my man Tanjiro that makes it in time, but these belts are so annoying. Again? Is our body going to be able to take that? What's the most you can do at this current time? Anything, honestly. He can combine them? Water with the small amounts of Kagura he can manage up right now? Oh my god. While his body is that tired and he has those injuries? Blend the breathing techniques. I never would have thought I would ever see this. A hundred percent. Because they rack their brain, their brains. That's why so many different offshoots have been created in the first place. Whether it be water, love, insect, beast, sound. That is true. You make it fit for you. Good. I was very nervous that when he came up with the decision to use Kagura, that he was going to give up water breathing forever. But everything has its own scenario in which it's useful. Oh. You have my gratitude. That's the biggest thing you could have done right there, is go to save his wife. <laughs> oh, good save. Yes. Oh my god, yes. But how are you going to do that? That's the greatest question. He's trying to rack his brain as we speak right now, and he just said, fuck it, we're just going to run straight at her. <laughs> fuck it. The way my man Zenny too. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I know, he's such a different breed. When he's asleep, this man is something else. And they, their swords just clap. Oh, wow. Oh. His things are like, yeah, absorbing in the, the Nichi Reed. He does have his backup sword. How are you going to stop? Oh, that's so broken. That's so broken. Meanwhile, oh my god, look what is going on over here. Now we have both fights coming together. I love this frozen in time shot, the 3D modeled belts and everything. Okay, focus, Zenny too. He's so serious right now. Look at that. Oh my god. The animation in this show is something else. Water basin. Oh, thank the Lord. Thank the- oh, that was beautiful right there. Thank the Lord. I, I'm so nervous we're gonna lose Hinatsuru. Monichi. That's so funny. The three of us together can beat her. Defeating an upper rank demon. Let's do this. Look at these. Look at this. This is literally all I've ever wanted is our main three going ham together against an upper rank, holding their own. Oh my god, this is amazing to see. Look at these two coming in. It's like we're playing the Demon Slayer game and you use your fucking substitute. Eighth Fang. Beast breathing Eighth Fang explosive rush. Oh. I'm oh my god, bro. Seeing these two work for Inosuke to come for this final move has me so bricked up under this table. Look at that! Oh my god, look at that! He's going through mad injuries. He's gonna make it though, I know he is. Sixth thing. Another beast- This is why we have these serrated fucking knives in the first place, oh my god! He's hacking her head off! Palisade bites. 
You guys have to let me know, is that pronounced Palisade or Palisade? He's just running out with the head. Now we have to help Tengen. We actually were able to deal with Daki, at least for now. So I am down. How did he get there? Oh, and the poison. I didn't even think of that. And that looked dead center on the chest. Yeah, what's going on with Tengen? That's my point. I was way too hyped for this episode. You can see, you can see the poison surging through his like body now for Oh my god. I thought this episode was going to be defeating an upper rank demon mo What the f Oh, that's probably the most dirty they've done me. Normally, I was about to. So, oh my! The fact of the. Oh my God! They don't. They don't give a shit, do they? Oh wow! Oh wow! I was going to talk this episode about how well this show makes me fear for characters' lives because I know character lives are on the line, but then also saves them in a good way and leaves it to where like they didn't need to die. And the whole time I was going to say this about Hinatsuru right now my favorite of the tengen wives and that's because not only was that not only were she, was she the one who said you know even if one of us or any of us were to die if we are able to defeat an upper rank demon let's as you know let's at some point call it and and live a normal life so we can at least help hold our head up at some point instead of holding it down our entire lives and even though our our siblings aka tengen siblings are dead you know like we gotta live life for them you know at, at one point and it's just and i, I do really i respect because it's the it's not the first time we've seen her be socially observant when makio was talking to her about tengen and why he is who he is you know she was like hey you know it's just she seems like such a caring nice soul and i just i don't know i appreciate her so much and for her for me to worry about her as much as I did this episode, I was I was sure that she was going to die. So this show, giving you that tense, not knowing what's going to happen next feeling is, is a great relief, honestly. Like, I'm waiting for my hero to get there because my hero is really good, but it also saves a lot of the characters a lot of the times. Whereas I know in this one, I turned around and Tengen's hand is cut off. Inosuke just got stabbed through the chest. Zenitsu was a millisecond away from dying right there. Like, I'm genuinely still concerned about all these characters. Tengen may still very much die in this arc, and I, I'm hoping not. I'm hoping not. But he has poison rushing through his body, and he has a chopped off arm. Hand, I should say, specifically. And Inosuke just got stabbed through the chest after that was such a great tandem teamwork play between Inosuke, Zenitsu, and Tanjiro. All working together harmoniously, whereas Tanjiro and Zenitsu were on defense, Inosuke was full-fledged running at her head. He used 8th form, and then in the 6th form of his beast breathing, which I love seeing beast breathing. We saw Zenitsu use his thunderclap and flash. We saw Inosuke use, not Inosuke, Tanjiro use Hinokami Kagura mixed with the water form to create the most efficient attack power he could come up with at the time. Like this is just insane and all and the animation the whole time is I don't even need to bring that up anymore It's just impeccable seeing Inosuke's beast like the blue the way they animate like the blue outward slashes then Zenitsu's thunderclap and flash the lightning with with Gyotaro's blood sickles just dark red flow Oh my god, it's so well done The animation everything the resolve the music the fights choreographs choreography i mean to say everything all around s tier episode s tier show obviously i just cannot believe they ended like that Not 10 times out of 10 in another anime or a show we're having somebody swoop in save the day being like sort of like an all might i am here type moment then they end it you get hype and you need to see the next episode but now it's the same exact thing except i think all the characters are going to die so i have no idea what's going to happen if you guys enjoyed 
please uh, leave a like. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. If you guys are not subscribed, please subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Follow all those social medias, Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, and Twitter, all at Dapper Darius. Much appreciated, y'all. Let's hop. I almost said let's hop into this. Oh, my God. That's how tired I am. That's how tired I am, guys. Don't forget to drink some water. Be safe out there. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace. I'll see you guys soon.